What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition HPI. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. Yeah, it's not. My bad. I gotta cover it up. It's not, man. <laughs> um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't, let it fly. Let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Free general quotes reading. Love you guys. Just saying, same. Okay, so um. This daily tea for 1029 and 2022. I hope everybody's doing well. I do, I do, I do who. Um, I do. All right, so we're going to roll with this. All right, so the channel message I received was um, uh, someone was trying very hard to, um, I heard to control you, um, to control you uh, and to tame you. But I heard through many series of shame events, it's about to seriously backfire on them. So, well, nobody should try to control or tame anybody. If anybody needs to hear, hashtag live free. If anybody needs to hear that, I get so sick and tired of pulling in the energy of people trying to control and dominate people with money. People trying to control and dominate people with stolen inheritances and taking away what's rightfully theirs. And people trying to control people by uh, the strings behind the scenes, by fraudulent paperwork and false POAs and all kinds of shit. I get so sick of that, and that's so fucking criminal, and I hope every single one of them fucking rots in prison. If anybody needs to hear that, and I'm just being serious, quit trying to control the narrative. It's not your narrative to control. If anybody needs to hear that, now, I'm not talking, you know, to the ones of you guys that aren't trying to control the narrative like that. I'm talking to the ones that are, or did, or is trying to. It's sick in the fucking head, and I hope their asses get caught by light side people and put their ass away. And I'm just being serious. It just, it pisses me off. I get so sick and tired of people... Doing shit like that. Do it the fucking right way if anybody needs to hear that. Do it the right way. Okay, so I heard um, somebody um, is trying very, very, very hard to control you. They're trying to tame you and control you and blase, blase, blase. People, cannot, people are not meant to be controlled or tamed. If anybody needs to hear that, they're not pieces of meat. People are not pieces of meat. People are not pawns and chess pieces. Pawns on a chessboard, if anybody needs to hear that. And that's just the damn truth. I mean, I'm not speaking to the ones of you guys that, um, you know, they're trying to control and domineer and use as pawns on a chessboard. I'm talking to the assholes that are, because I'm sure they watch my channel too. Just saying, just saying. Who's about to seriously backfire on them? One is about to move out of state. Far away. One is about to get a, a acquire property, money, assets they should have a long time ago. There are many series of chain of events. Okay, so there's at least two of you in here. They're trying to control and dominate. If this may, uh, if this resonates for you, there's at least two of you guys. I think it can be divine masculine or divine fem. You plug it in how it resonates. Okay, but severe trying to control and dominate confirmation severe controlling and domineering or attempted controlling and domineering this reminds me of like i'll give you an example when i was a teenager and i was the only one of four this happened to the only one my foster monster made sure that basically i spent my entire teenage life it grounded in a laundry room for four years Ninth through 12th grade. I was on the dance team, and I was only on the dance team for a little while. She made sure I got kicked off of that. So, I, that didn't even last long. So, I mean, that doesn't even really count. But, work, I worked as a teenager, and I went to school. Other than that, I sat in the laundry room. Now, when she was on business trips for the government, my dad never made me stay in the laundry room. He never told her that. But he didn't, because he knew. He knew what she was doing was wrong, but he had to support her. So, um, to the family. But I never stayed in the laundry room, not one bit, when she was gone. And trust me, she was gone a lot, because she liked to fuck around on me. 
She liked to fuck around and cheat on him. And he knew it. I knew it. The whole family knew it. So, just saying, just, I'll just, that's just an example. But I'm just saying. Okay, so somebody wants to control and dominate you. There's at least two of you guys. You plug in and how it resonates. Wants to control and dominate you, make you, make you basically like a pawn on a chessboard, basically. That's what they want to do. But I heard for one, it's both of them are going to backfire. Both are going to backfire. One, you're about to move very far distances. I heard out of state. So far, far distances out of state, whatever state you're in and reside in now and how that resonates. One, you're about to, through many series of chain of events, you're about to get money, assets, and property. You should have had, um, sorry, you should have had a long time ago. So you plug it in how it resonates, man. Well, that's what they get. Um, and the thing is, is I heard you should have had the money, property, and assets a long time ago. I hope somebody gets charged with a large-ass fine or gets put in jail for holding the money, property, and assets back from you. That's criminal. Be my needs to hear that. So you have to put yourself in where you fit. Are you moving out of state, far distances, so you're not going to be controlled and dominated? Or you about to acquire assets, money, and property that was yours the whole damn time, but assholes, criminal assholes, basically have strategically been holding it back from you. You plug it in how it resonates, man. We have the psychic eye card. You are very highly psychic. The one that's about to move, you know it is the smart thing to do. And you are moving very far away from everybody, everybody. And the one you're about to receive the money and the property and the assets, you have scared the hell out of these people for years. They were fearing that you would have money and they didn't want you to have control with money, but you they know you're going to get it anyways. And you will. The mini series of chain events, you're about to get your rightful money, property, assets. Okay, so I'm pulling in two of you guys real quick. I mean, real quick, not real quick, uh, real strong, real strong. Psychics, you're both psychic, both of you. So, uh, you have to plug yourself in where you fit in the psychic realm if you fit over here, okay? Uh, but one of you guys, um, you're both very psychic, masculine or femme. You're both very psychic. You plug yourself in where you fit. But one of you, um, you're about to move. You're about to move. I heard you knew you should have moved a long time ago. You knew you should have moved a long time ago, and I heard you're about to. You're about to, and I heard you're about to move far away from basically everybody. Everybody, everybody, everybody. It sounds like a brand new, like a whole new, a whole new world. That's what it sounds like. A whole new world energy over here. Um, you're about to um, move away from every fucking body. And trust me, well, I'm cool doing that. I mean, I'm okay doing that. I just don't speak to nobody here. So it doesn't affect me. I mean, it's like a whole new world every day to me because I don't speak to no fucking body in my community. And that's just the truth. But um, I just want to save up to travel. But everybody's different. Everybody's different. So, but you're about to move far away. You're about to move far away, whoever you are. You are highly intuitive. You're psychic. And you know it's the best option for you. And it sounds like from everybody. From lovers, past lovers, friends, frenemies, um, community members, everybody, basically. For situation one, psychic. For some of you, you Pisces, because it's, you know, Pisces energy, or have Pisces in your chart, or not. You plug in how it resonates. For the other one of you guys, uh, well, other one of you guys, somebody's strategically holding back money, property, and assets from you. But I heard through many series of chain events, 
they were I heard they were strategically holding them back from you because they didn't want you to have power like the power card and the um they didn't want you to have power financial power financial backing basically so they were holding back what was rightfully yours which is financial abuse if anybody needs to hear that and they wouldn't appreciate that if it was done to them and that's just the damn truth for real for it god forbid it happened to them but they have the abuse of power in for reverse energy and they do it to other people that's not okay and that's where people get negative karma. And they're all like, oh, why did I get negative karma? Well, because you're trying to control a fucking narrative, you ass wife, when you can't be controlling the narrative for other people. If anybody needs to hear that, leave people the fuck alone. What's theirs is theirs. Money, property, and assets is theirs. I heard um, they didn't want you to have power of money, sir, ma'am. They didn't want you to have financial backing. They didn't want you to be powerful having money. But I heard you're going to get it anyways, and they know it. Meaning, you're going to have money anyways. You're going to be wealthy and prosperous anyways. They know you are. For some, I feel you already are. <laughs> and that's why you're they're, you're about to get it anyways. The um, money, property, assets. Because you already are thriving. You already do have money. You're already building yourself up or has built yourself up. They know this, but God forbid they didn't want you to have it in the past. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit. Are you the one? You're both very psychic, masculine or femme. Are you about to move very, 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 very far distances? Out of state, I heard. Or are you about to get money, property, assets you should have had a long time ago? You plug it in, how it resonates. But whoever you are over here, well, both of you, they're, they're uh, I think they're afraid of you for both of you. Especially this one. Especially this one. Because if you go to greater lengths to hold back money, property, assets from somebody, that is, they see you as a huge threat. They see you as a huge threat. But through many series of chain events, this is about to happen for you, and you're about to be very graceful and very tactful, and you're just going to go in and handle your business and sit on your throne. Not harm anybody, not talk bad about anybody, just handle your business. That's the way you do it, queen. If that resonates for you, or king, you can be a queen or a king. Absolutely. That's that's the graceful type. I heard you graceful and tactful, and that's the most graceful, tactful way you can do it. I heard they really don't want you to have this man. Whoever you are, they really don't want you to have it. I mean, damn, they don't want you to have it. I think you already know, but. I'm just reiterating. I'm just letting you know if you didn't know, okay? They really don't want you to fuck the habit. They don't. But they can't control the narrative anymore. They can't control it anymore. They cannot control your narrative. They want you to con the, the control the narrative so bad. The narrative is about to blow up in their face. The narrative is about to blow up in their face. The narrative is about to blow up in their face. Well, that's what you get for trying to control somebody else's narrative, i.e. somebody else's life. Like pawns on a chessboard that sit in the fucking head. Just saying. But anyway, so um, they really don't want you to have it, though. I've said it like four times, but I'm four times confirming for you. Just saying, just saying. But anyway, so. Uh, but you're going to get it. You're going to get it anyways. It's not. They shouldn't be trying to control the narrative. That's where negative karma comes into play. Oh, I got in this horrific accident. And I'm in the hospital for 30 days. Oh, poor me. Why did I, that happen to me? Well, maybe because you're behind the scenes trying to um, hold back somebody's money, property, or assets. Be my needs to hear that. Oh, my God. I'm losing my vision. Oh, my God. Why, why does this happen to me? Well, behind the scenes, you're trying to, you're holding back secretly somebody's money, property, or assets. Oh, my God. My house is so haunted. It's so, so fucking haunted. Why did I deserve, this? why did I deserve angry spirits? Oh, my God. Well. You're holding back somebody's money, property, your assets behind the scenes. What are you doing behind the scenes, either in a positive or a negative way, if anybody needs to hear that? And I'm just being for real. That's where negative karma comes into play. And that's just the truth. So anyways, yes. Yeah, so, But I heard you're about to get it. And I heard um, you're just going to go in there very gracefully, very tactfully, handle your business. So I'm assuming signing paperwork that you need to sign. Or um, getting a lawyer, if you need to get a lawyer to go in there with you, 
um, a property lawyer. There's property lawyers where people don't know. There's many types of law. There's fa uh, family law. There's uh, probate. There's um, uh, civil. There's criminal. There's um, uh, property. So whatever, you know, I feel for some, you know, you might get a lawyer to go in there with you, possibly, uh, possibly. You plug it in how it resonates, or a lawyer might call you um, regarding this, okay? I feel, I mean, I'm feeling lawyer energy here. I mean, I'm, I'm serious. I'm feeling lawyer energy here, and I'm just being for real. Um, notifying you, possibly, is what I'm feeling. I mean, how else are they going to do it? It would have to be through a lawyer, to my knowledge. I mean, I don't work in the legal sector, but their unlocking unveiling of wheels are done through lawyers. And that's just the truth. So, you know, you plug it in how it resonates. But whoever you are, they unlocked and unveiled the wheel behind your back. They most certainly did. And they were pissed that you were in it. It's about to backfire on them in such a huge way. Okay, I heard they most certainly did. So they unlocked and unveiled the wheel behind your back. But, um, and you know, that's done through a lawyer. Um, I've never been in an unlocking or unveiling of a wheel, but I have heard about it. So, um, but, you know, lawyers do that. Do that with the clients. But anyway, so, um, but I heard this person, um, you, they unlocked and unveiled the wheel behind your back. But I heard, um, uh, it basically pisses them off that you were in it. They didn't realize you were in it. It's about to come out whether they want, want it to or not. It's about to come out whether they want it to or not. I heard it's about to come out whether they want it to or not. So it's about the, um, the fact that you had these money at property or assets. Um, it sounds like in a wheel. It sounds like in a wheel in the past. Um, a stolen inheritance, basically, that was given to somebody else. It's it's about to come out anyways, whether they want it to or not. This grandmother loved you so much. So much. You really need to hear this. And she is very pissed off. And she will keep being pissed off until this was resolved. Okay. For whoever you are over here, I heard this grandmother loved you so much, so much. You need to um, hear this, whoever you are in this category. Now, you haven't got your stolen inheritance back yet, whoever you are, sir, ma'am. You ain't got it back yet. But there is a grandmother, and I think it's that same grandmother spirit I've been picking up very, very, very strong, very strong. I heard she loved you so, so, so much, and uh, basically, um, you were about to, um, you're, she loved you very much, if you didn't know, sir, ma'am. She loved you very, very, very much, and basically, you're about to get, um, uh, you're about to get it, you know, whether these people want, want you to get it or not. So you plug it in how it resonates. And through many series of chain events, a Libra that has a stolen inheritance, another stolen inheritance, a masculine veteran stolen inheritance, they're, through many series of chain of events, they're about to be forced to give it up. They're about to be pissed. Oh, my God. And, uh, uh, okay, so uh, there's two stolen inheritances. This one was a stolen inheritance. This, you, sir, ma'am, you're about to move out of state, far, whoever you are. Um, This one is stolen inheritance. Then we have another one. And I heard a, through many series of chain events, a Libra that has a stolen inheritance, another stolen inheritance. I heard of a masculine veteran. Um, so this person has a stolen inheritance, a Libra, a masculine Libra. They can have Libra in any aspects of their charts. Um, they have a stolen inheritance of a veteran, a masculine veteran. <clears throat> I heard through many series of chain events, they're about to be forced to give it up, and I heard they're going to be pissed. Well, that's what you get when you steal people. How the hell are... There's at least two stolen inheritances in the universe. At least two. How are people getting away with this? You... That's not okay. Yes, we have scammers, spammers, frauders. So much so we have Federal Trade Commission. But damn. 
Quit, you know, what? Somebody needs to take better care of documentation and better care of finances and better care of what the hell? I mean, what? How did somebody allow this to happen is what I'm trying to say. This is, that's severe abuse of power in its finest. People in positions of high authority that fraud and scam and allow frauding and scamming. Well, okay, until your ass ends up in prison. Just saying, just saying. So this one's about to be returned too. This one, there's a grandmother spirit. I think this is the haunting one I've been picking up. The haunting one I've been picking up is exactly what I think. Grandmother spirit been haunting the hell out of somebody that has somebody else's um, inheritance. Haunting the hell out of the home and the property and the assets and getting their posse game to haunt the hell out of them too. And honestly, if that happened to me, what if I passed away and I and that I knew saw this shit happen in 3D physical, you better believe I'd be big ass spirit down here haunting the fuck out of people. And that's just the truth. So I don't blame you, grandmother spirit. You felt your fat ass self, ma'am. I love you in the spiritual realm. You're my kind of person. I pass over, I'd be hanging out in your crew. And that's just the truth. Share messages, okay. Family, family tree, bloodline. This is about to piss off family members, but the community does not care anymore. And the person about to receive the stolen inheritance does not care. It was theft. And through any series of chain events, some of these people might end up in jail. Possibly. Well, I don't possibly, but the thing is that they should end up in jail. That's called theft. But it sounds like these people are about to work it out behind the scenes, is what it sounds like. It's about to be worked out behind the scenes. Quickly. Because things have already gotten way out of hand, and they will continue until this is resolved. Okay, there's confirmation. I heard behind the scenes. And I heard uh, it's going to be worked out quickly uh, behind the scenes because th so many things, negative things have already happened. Um, and more will happen, I heard, until it's resolved. So if anybody needs to hear that, until these two inheritances, because I'm picking up at least two inheritances. This is a stolen grandmother spirit's uh, inheritance. This is a stolen masculine veteran spirit's inheritance. There's at least two in here. And then one person that's highly psychic and intuitive about to move far locations states um but i heard basically um i heard it, bad things have already happened are they going to continue to happen until these at least two inheritances are returned in the universe if anybody needs to hear that i'm sure there's more stolen inheritances out there but there is at least two so family tree family bloodline i think this is the grandmother spirit energy very strong piss off with this one um and um about to really, 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 um, I mean, these people aren't messing around, man. I'm just being for real. Many shocking series of chain events are about to happen in a particular Pisces life. The wheel's about to start moving fast for them. They're about to make it start moving fast. Take it, about to connect, take control of their own life. One, they are moving far distances. For one, they're about to make very significant, huge changes in their life. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So um, there's at least two Pisces. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. Pisces in energy. You got Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Moon, Midheim, or Jupiter charts. But you're taking control, the driver's seat of your own life, basically. You're about to take the driver's seat of your own life. 
Now, how, one of them, I, one of them, I feel you're over here. You're about to move far distances. I feel you're highly psychic and intuitive. You're about to move far distances. You're about to take the driver's seat of your own life. That's for one. Now, you can be masculine or femme. You plug it in how it resonates. I feel for one of you guys, you are Pisces. You have Pisces in your chart up here. Um, but for the other one, um, I heard uh, whether if you're not moving, you're not moving. Only you know if you're about to move far distances or not. But for the other one, you're about to make huge changes in your life. So I feel, you know.